Hi, welcome back to Malta TV, the online channel that brings you the best from the Maltese islands. This year, Intercontinental Malta has launched a variety of luxury services and experiences to add to their existing portfolio, and we are here to experience some of them. Hi, how are you? <laughs> Very good. Welcome to the Intercontinental. Thank you for Thank coming. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Michael, from Budapest to Malta, what brought you here in the first place? Interesting, I know. Um, well, we spent, you know, as a family, fantastic two years at the Intercontinental in Budapest. Budapest was very vibrant as a city um, and the family was very well integrated already. So I have to say, it was not an easy decision. Uh -huh. But at the end, you know, when you do have a, a newborn, a uh, 13-month-old, um, things change in terms of perspective. So, uh, and then we've heard, of course, Malta had a great quality of life, so everything uh, added up. But most importantly, um, aside the family, of course, was the project itself mm -hmm. and uh, the conviction that uh, we can do something special here uh, at the Intercontinental and, uh, and in Malta. So Excellent. that's what brought me here. Can you tell us about the recent uh, investments that have been made by the Intercontinental Malta? Of course, uh, I have to say it's been great investments. Uh, everyone uh, knows about it. And uh, our owners, they are strong believers that uh, Malta needed a bit of uplift in terms of quality. Mm -hmm. And the likes of the Sky Beach, the likes of the Highland Suites, of the Club Intercontinental and even the Bay Arena, they bring exactly that uh, to Malta. And they contribute seriously to the business mix that we want to offer and most importantly they go straight into the heart of our guest experience and this is why we are here. Um, and they also contribute selectively and individually in, in different segments and yeah. we're seeing an uplift in that, we're seeing a different type of, of guests come into the hotel and uh, that also supports the repositioning of the Intercontinental, not only to our local community, uh, of course, but most um, also equally important to our foreign uh, guests and community as well. Michael, what uh, would you like to achieve with your team this year and the next? We would like to build a successful team, a team that is proud to work here, um, a team that sees the hotel growing and uh, because we want to be one of the leading hotels in, uh, in Malta. And to go back to our stakeholders as well with uh, a clear idea of what we want to be in the future uh, and to deliver positive mid to long year forecasts. That's our goal and of course uh, just to make sure that our team members and their respective families, uh, they feel proud to all contribute to this uh, fantastic project. That's, that's our main goal for, for the upcoming three years. Michael, thank you so much for having us. We really enjoyed our, our stay here. Um, I hope you enjoyed our feature and hope to see you in the next episode of Malta TV. Bye.